when we're dealing with the uh, finer wire, uh, so for example when we're wiring branches, um, it's, uh, it's a good idea to use much smaller tools such as these. Uh, these will cut through the fine wire very easily. Um, good point about these tools, uh, this tool in particular, is that it sits in the palm of your hand like this. So when you're uh, sap wiring the tree and uh, applying wires to the branch like so, and cut the wire without having to keep picking up and dropping the tool. So it sits there, very nice, very quick and easy to use. Uh, another another uh, two varieties here, slightly longer handles and uh, slightly different um, cutting edge there. Again, these are for the thinner wire. Um, all, all of these three will actually cut up to about two, uh, two and a half millimetre uh, copper wire very easily. Yes. So these wire cutters will all cut copper wire uh, to about three millimetre thickness, two three millimetre thickness. Um, but I'm having to squeeze very hard here. Uh, if you have to put a lot of effort into into cutting through the, the, the wire, then there's a good likelihood that you'll damage, you'll bend the uh, the arms here, and also damage the um, damage the cutting edges. Uh, so if you've got to press too hard then you're obviously using the wrong tool. Um, so use a use a much heavy juice much more heavy juice wire cutter. The benefit of these uh, of these wire cutters though is that when you're removing wire from a tree you can get into the tree much much more easier. So as you can see here we can get inside the tree a lot easier to cut the wire.